Throw away the pumpkins, get out the turkey, and prepare yourself for Christmas and for the John Waters Christmas Show, which is on its way back to Baltimore for two performances only. Yeah, people are excited. The so-called Pope of Trash has a brand new version of what he calls his comedy show from hell. And Denise Coe caught up with John to find out what to expect from Christmas, but John <laughs> Waters style, Denise. Indeed, in December, John will bring his brand of new Christmas show to 20 venues in 23 days all across the country. This morning, the guy who calls himself the Saint Nick of Nutcases came home to start work on a John Waters Christmas. Let's blow it up. So I just came back this morning on the train from New York. Oh, wonderful. Well, welcome home. Thank you. It's great to be home. <laughs> You're such a big deal now. I'm impressed to be able to talk to you. You got a Hollywood star. It seems glamorous, crazy, funny, everything. I never even hoped for all this. So it's all gravy and exciting with no irony. It's just I'm very proud. As I say, I'm so respectable I could puke. <laughs> all right. Well, we're talking today about your Christmas show. Now, I know you've done one in the past. Is Has it been revamped? Do you update oh, it? Completely. What do you do? It is not one word the same as the last Christmas show. I, I re rewrite it totally once a year, which is a huge deal to write a 70 minute show and memorize it. That's the heart of it. <laughs> the material comes from, well, from the mind of John Waters and memories of Christmas past. I mean, sometimes terrible things happen that are great, like when the Christmas tree fell over on my grandmother. Now people all over the world tell me stories. It happens a lot. It's usually liquor or the dog. <laughs> and you absorb these stories into oh, your show? Oh, yeah, yeah. And people give me the greatest Christmas stuff. Do you like Christmas? Do you celebrate Christmas? Yeah, I do with my family and everything, very much so. I, I celebrate it. I have my own version of my Christmas decorations. I always used to decorate the electric chair in my house from Female Troubles. It makes the telephone repairmen very nervous when they come in the house. But the electric chair is in the Academy Awards show. So I can't decorate it this year. They've taken my Christmas tree away. A John Waters Christmas where Fat Daddy sings, and at the end, the audience gets to ask questions. Someone did ask me in Baltimore the last year. They said, my father told me he almost went home with you in a bar one night. And I said, well, tell him hi. <laughs> but Baltimore's special. Oh, yeah, it is. It's usually the closing night is Baltimore, which I like. I better have learned it by then. I, I think he will have. Okay. So the Academy Museum that he mentioned, in conjunction with him getting the star, huge exhibit yeah. of a retrospective of all his work, and that's where I guess the electric chair is right now. All right, there are only two nights in Baltimore. December 21st and 22nd is at the sound stage, the Baltimore sound stage. It sells out, so if you want to go, you better get your tickets. It will be funny. That I He's can hilarious. He, he is. is. <laughs> it's nonstop. And he rewrote the whole show. Not a single word from the last one. And, and has uh, to memorize it. Uh, yeah, can you imagine that? Seven I cannot. No. But he is a brilliant monologuist. Brilliant. I think you got a Christmas invite, too. You better take him up on that. If he invites me, I'm going. You'll you better be there, believe it. All right? <laughs>